So today we're in Anza Borrego and we're at our favorite campsite that's tucked away off the grid. Uh, nobody's around, which is always perfect. And I wanted to do a quick uh, video review of the front runner roof rack and also ladder for the Land Rover LR4. Uh, now we got this for two reasons. One is that we have a photography studio and it's very handy to get uh, up on the top of the roof rack and shoot. Uh, you get a much different vantage point for the photography and video that we do. So the nice thing about the front runner rack is it's got a ton of accessories for water bottles, fuel bottles, propane bottles. Uh, you can carry the uh, ammo boxes up there. Uh, basically anything you could strap up there you could take and put up there. So for many years I said I would never do this, um, but I've got to the point now where uh, when we go on longer trip it's just very difficult to get everything in the car and the added advantage of having the different perspective um, of the, uh, for the studio makes, uh, makes it very compelling to have it. So uh, while I was up at Front Runner the other day, I had them install this very nice custom uh, ladder that ties into the existing bodywork of the LR4. So, you can... so it's uh, very integrated, uh, very sturdy. You can pull on it, it's not, it doesn't wobble or anything. It will absolutely hold all of the weight that I have. And uh, basically what you do is use the first step will be the back of the bumper. And then second step is right above the license plate, plate light. And then two more, and then you have an upper step here. And that gets you up into onto the uh, roof rack. So. Um, not cheap again, but Front Runner does a really great job in the quality of the build. And I actually had them install it for me, and uh, they were they pulled the entire inside of the uh, trim off the car to get it installed, and, and it did a really nice job. So I'm happy about that. But that's uh, that's the ladder and the rack, and I've got uh, so far I've got the propane uh, tank carrier. And I think probably the next thing we're going to be buying will be uh, the gas can or water um, carriers because that's uh, something that takes up a lot of room inside the car. So just to give you an idea how sturdy this is, I'm actually going to go ahead and crawl up on it and hopefully I will not fall and uh, break my, my neck today. But this gives you an idea of how uh, solid this, this whole thing is. So step up here on the bumper. So, so far I would say two thumbs up on the front runner roof rack, very, very sturdy. Lots of accessories you can get, uh, does a great job for our unforgettable studios, giving us different vantage points for video and also for stills. And uh, all the accessories that come with it, I think it's an excellent buy. At some point, might even be looking at a rooftop tent, but I'm not sure yet, but I finally made the move to actually have a, a rack on the car, and I like it a lot. Now, one thing about the LR4 is there are three sunroofs on the car. The only one that actually opens is the front one, and uh, what we've done is taken, put pretty much solid slats towards the back of the rack, and then opened it up towards the front but this rack does not run the full length of the roof, so the front sunroof is still open space, and that's the way I would like to leave it at this point. Um, hey, this is Jeffrey Douglas. Thanks so much for stopping by. Check us out again, and I hope you're having a great day.